Hello. Here we are with our mega baby haul. How many days? 14 days 14 to go. days to go until this little fella will be entering the world and we've got loads of stuff to show you. So we're not going to mess around, we're going to jump straight in because there's lots to get through. I'm going to start off with lotions and potions and all that jazz first. So first up we've got a vino baby. Now I've never tried this stuff but I'm really excited to try it because a lot of people rave about this stuff. So we've got the baby gentle wash, we've got the soothing relief baby emollient cream, I'm going to say ailment then, and baby barrier cream. So bump cream. Let's have a look at this one. Oh it looks it looks nice and thick. It's like a soda creme type consistency. Nice. Oh, oh, mist. Soothing relief, baby. Oil and wash. I'm quite excited to use these things because Travis and Roman have both got quite sensitive skin. So I think this stuff is going to be good. Especially the soothing relief. Clin clinically proven to soothe and moisturise dry skin. So yes, excited to use these bad boys. Next up we have Pure Potions. Now, I've not actually heard of this brand before, but it was the... Natural Health International Beauty Award winner of 2017 and it's apparently the best eczema range. Again, like I said before, Travis and Roman both had quite sensitive skin so again this stuff is going to be, I think it's going to be a bit of a lifesaver. So we've got the Lavender Nappy Salve, so we're going to have some lovely soft bums in this house. Daily Moisturising Cream, Intensive Hand Cream, I'm a bit of a germaphobe, I'm constantly sanitising my hands so that'll be good for me. What else do we have? Intensive Moisturising Ointment, again all this stuff is really good if you've got dry, eczema prone skin, psoriasis and dermatitis, and what's this one, scalp oil, excited to use this because Roman was horrendous with um, cradle cap, yeah it was, we, nothing we tried could get rid of that so excited to use this hopefully, well hopefully baby won't have cradle cap but if he does I'm sure this will come to our rescue. Apparently my this baby already has a full head of hair so this adorably cute rock and ruddle hairbrush is going to come in handy. It's made out of, yes, boar bristles. Soft boar. Soft boar. So yeah, it's lovely and soft. I don't want to take it out of the box because it's so lovely. But look at the design. Hopefully you can see that. I'll zoom in. Little duckies. Little ducks. But yeah, there's so many cool designs. If you can see that. There you go. Definitely check them out because, yeah, this is so cute. It's a good gift as well, I don't see. Really good gift. A baby shower gift. Something you very unique. Mm. Love it. We like unique things. The tried and tested Sudder Creme. Now, for you, those of you that are brand loyal, sort of can care and protect. It's renowned. Everybody knows all about it. For Can't your baby's delicate skin every day. Can't go wrong with that one. Nope. Next up we have Epiderm, another brand that I've not really heard much about but again there seems there must be a lot of people in the world who suffer from eczema and psoriasis because most of these things seem to be targeted, that's the one, targeted towards those people so again my kids have got sensitive dry sore prone skin so again these things are going to be amazing dry skin eczema psoriasis fragrance and coloring and sls free doctor recommended doctor recommended so the next brand is a den from denmark i'm not even going to try and pronounce it but i think i would say it's er tekram <laughs> is my guess but anyway they do all sorts of um products starting with this is the children's spray conditioner let me have a smell let me have a smell Oh. Mmm, nice. Nice? Yeah, it is nice. Organic. Certified organic. And they're cruelty free as well. Shampoo. This one's got no perfume, so there's no point in you smelling this one. Mm. All over wash. Again, no perfume. Suitable for baby. And then this is the children's shampoo. This one. I bet this one's got a smell. I think it's the same as this one. Is it the same as that? <coughs> Ooh, squirting. <laughs> <laughs> Not overly strong smell. No, so a lot of a lot of baby yeah. stuff is quite. Um, Hundred percent uh, cruelty free, vegan, vegan. So that's if you're big. Into that sort so of thing. yeah, and then last one is children's tooth toothpaste. Let me test some. Mm. 
Yeah. I used to eat toothpaste as a child. Oh, it smells nice. Right. Tutti frutti. Mmm. That is tutti frutti. I wouldn't consider eating it though. <laughs> that was. I'm going to try it now. You, you tecrum. Cool. Next uh, brand up is Coleaf. Now, Coleaf is another one, like Luke said, with soda creme. This is a tried, with me especially, this is tried and tested. Even I've heard of this Yeah, brand. one of the things I've not actually used before, um, but will be using, but other two uh, we have. No other one we have. So, first one is the baby scalp oil, again, hopefully. If we have a very cradly head baby, this mm. should work. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't try that. I've not tried this one before and I don't know why I didn't. Nice. Next is the Vitamin Drops. Now in this country we don't get much sunshine so it is recommended that um, children do have Vitamin Drops. Didn't know that. Did you not? Fact there you go. Day. It is. Um, and this one we have actually used. Again, both our kids have struggled with um, milk when they're young, breast milk and formula milk, whether it's been a lactose allergy or what, but they, these really do help. You put it into the milk and it breaks down the lactose in the milk. So yeah, a couple of drops in your milk and yeah, Travis was the worst. And the day we brought that home, his first bottle, he was a different child. 90 servings as well so it may be a little bottle it's whatever. a small bottle but you literally have two or three tiny, drops yeah. per uh like milk feeding but literally do you not remember yeah i do remember yeah we were at our wit's it's end worth, worth every penny we were at our wit's end and we tried that and literally one bottle and he was a different child yeah he would scream after each feeding he couldn't really go to the toilet very well but yeah life Listen. saver and last thing is the mum to be moisturising cream. Uh, I've actually been using this and so far I've got no new stretch marks this pregnancy. Winning. Yay. Winning. So this is the Ovalum, I hope I pronounced that right, bath oil. Now I've used this. Pregnant I've not ladies been able to. have to be very careful when it comes to essential oils, apparently. I didn't even know that, but you do, don't you? Yep, you do. Um, this is amazing. So yeah. once you've had baby, I'd highly suggest using this. You're only supposed you've to probably use used all of it though. By probably. the time it you're comes. only supposed to use so many drops in your bath, but it like it's it's so strong. It's, it's so strong. He has it, and he, when he puts it in his bath, literally the whole house smells Combined amazing. Combined to help ease stress and relax tension in both mind and body, bringing you back to your complete and natural self. It does smell amazing. This will save you after a busy day with the kids at work, <laughs> mums, dads and everything in between, use this. So I'm going to hide this one now so he doesn't use it. Okay, so I think that is it for lotions and potions. Next we're going to move on to baby feeding. So with past two babies and this one, I really hope to be able to breastfeed, but it doesn't come naturally to me as much as it does to other mums. So I do tend to struggle. So to be on the safe side, we are prepared uh, with bottles as well. Um, with Roman, Mam Dummies were the best. So I wanted to use Mam Dummies again, so decided this time to go with the Mam Anticolic bottles. Uh, great reviews, people, what is this? Less colic confirmed by 80% of mothers. Now we tend to get colicky babies, so hopefully these do the trick and I just I really I just love the design of them these ones have got little foxes on They're like self sterilizing aren't they yeah and there is um the, you can self sterilize them I'm not entirely sure how but it's something to do with you take the bottom off and turn things upside down fill a bit of water and put them in the microwave three minutes done yeah but yes I'm sure you've heard of ma'am amazing we've also got the oral care rabbit I showed my mum this and she was like what on earth is this and it's to when you first ba to get your babies used to brushing the teeth basically. So you put in. your fingers in the little ears and you can massage the gums. Probably good when they're teething as well. And when they first get the little teeth coming through, it's a, probably going to be a little bit easier than it's a good trying, idea. To, trying to do with a Never brush. ever thought about that. No, so. super cute. So I'm excited to use that. And cool. it's a bunny. I help prevent infant tooth decay. He does. Have to name Rabbit. him. Next up, another. Big name in the baby world. Big name world. in the baby world and another life saver. Lanolin Lantano nipple cream. 
don't skimp on nipple cream. I've tried with cheaper brands just to save a bit of money and they don't work. This is the bomb.com. It's the best stuff. Seriously, if you struggle breastfeeding, first few days, sore nipples, cracked nipples. Oof. What us mothers Can't go imagine. through. Can't this imagine. stuff, it's the best. But also, um, I've talked about the boy's skin problems quite a lot. But both our babies have really bad dribble mm. rash on their cheeks. And I would go out and people in the streets would comment on it. And it's awful. They just have really bright red chapped cheeks from dribbling so much. This stuff cleared it up straight away. So yes. There you go. Amazing stuff. Love it. By the way, all the links of the products will be in the description below. Yes. Uh, also, we've got a Lansano bottle as well. Not all babies will take one bottle. So just because I really like these, mm. baby might not even use them. So it's good to have a backup. So the Lansano, another, again, it's a trusted brand. So hopefully, if he doesn't want the man ones, he'll go for this one. But it's, also, it's always good to have spares. Plan B storage bags for breast milk again hopefully I should be able to breastfeed um, if not I do have a pump so if I can't breastfeed as well as I can I can pump and store my milk essentials. in these bags essentials the Lansano nipple pads breast milk pads should I say again the best don't scrimp I've tried the cheap ones trying to save money and the rubbish these ones are good so Stops leakage. Yeah. <laughs> uh, another thing we have, which we've never tried before, is the Snuffle Babe n uh, nasal as is it an aspirator? aspirator? Aspirator. I've seen these on YouTube and people go a bit crazy over them, but I've never tried one. In a good or a bad way. In a good way. Oh, like right. They're amazing. But I've never tried one. Basically, if you don't know what it is, you put this big end in baby's nose if they're very snotty and blocked up, and then you suck on the other end. How does but it there is oh. a little thing somewhere, filter, filter, that's the word, to stop any bogeys going anywhere. But yeah, really good, especially if you get really congested babies, and especially um, C-section babies, mm -hmm. they're very mucusy. Oh yeah, I've heard that. Um, and we are C-section. And we are having a C-section, so hopefully this should come to the rescue. We've actually got three of these, so... We're going to do a giveaway. So if you comment below, like the video, and um, we'll just pick some people at random. If you want one, or oh, we'll give two away. Depends on how many people want them or need them. But Full yeah. rules will be in the description box. This next um, item, I need to actually do it this week. Um, I tried to do it a couple of weeks ago, but you had to be 35 weeks. And I'm 37 now, so I need to do it ASAP. ASAP. It is a Group B strep test. Now, if you're in America, you'd be thinking, why would I need this? Because you guys get to do them automatically. Here in the UK, it's not. So... Um, if you don't know about Group B strep, I'd say do your research on it because it can be life-threatening for babies. If a mum passes it on to them, if the mum's obviously obviously a carrier, and they can, that can be transferred either by C-section or a vaginal birth, um, it can be very dangerous for babies. So yes, I'm going to be getting that done. It's two little swabs that you do, send them off, and then you get your results. Doesn't, it's not a big deal if you have it, it just means there's going to be extra precautions taken when you're giving birth, so yes. Good idea. Check that out. So check out these cute clothes. These are sent to us by Blade and Rose, not to six months. So you will have that one if you don't mind, my dear. Look at the bum. Yeah, they're super cute. She loves clothes, we've got loads. Um, Blade and Rose, cool designs. Check their website out. So cute. Super Brand cool. I love the bum. Blade and Rose, UK company. Go check them out. Next up, we have this baby wrapped carrier by Yoga Bellies. Uh, we got sent this before we knew what we were having. So we are having a boy and it is pink. So another giveaway. If you fancy your chances of getting this baby wrap, um, full instructions and things you have to do will be in the description box. But yeah, I love baby wraps. I'm really disappointed. I was really sad that this, that this was pink. But yeah, baby wraps are awesome. So yeah, if you want to win this, check out the rules in the description box. To become one. Emma Bunton has an, a range, co-created a range called Kit and Kin. Now this box they sent us is really, really nice and, and I'm going to spoil it. And I'm waiting to spill everything and spoil it. There we go. We've got some Ooh. essentials in here. 
some baby essentials I go through with you now. But anyway, it's packed really nicely. I'll go through it, my dear. Baby oil. Well, oh, the thing, uh, the idea behind all of these is it's all very natural. Um, sorry, carry on. Stretch mark oil. I can never have too much stretch mark oil. Breast balm. Ooh. Um, magic salve. Mm. They're all supposed to smell amazing as well. Mm. Nice. Blend of naturally nourishing oils and botanical extracts. Kittenkin.com. Care for mum and babies, so. Oh my god. That is really nice. Um, hair and body oh. wash. There, cleansing oh. and softening. Oh my god, that's amazing. And some bubble bath. Oh, bubble bath. We love bubble bath in this house. Can't have enough, but the idea of it being oh, very gentle and soft on your baby's skin. I love these bags. I take them everywhere with me. Uh, we also got some nappy sacks. Are these biodegradable? Yes. Yes, that's the biodegradable. idea. Biodegradable. Amazing. Um, these will definitely be going in my nappy bag. And we also got some nappies, which are also biodegradable, which I think all nappies are going to have to go this way very soon. Yeah. Really cute designs as well. Oh, cute they? designs. And the idea being is oh, that... They do. Yeah, they do. They're really nice. And um, the idea being that you you can put them on the side in your room and you know some nappies just look awful. Well, these are designed, including the packaging, I don't to look to super cool them. in your bathroom. Is it a hedgehog? In your room downstairs. Yeah. Maybe hedgehog. That's so cute. So cute. So, yeah, and so, by Emma Bunton. There you go. I do like Emma Bunton. She yes. was, was she, who was your favourite Spice Girl? Emma Bunton. Oh, there we go. Baby Spice. Baby Spice. Get it? She's got a few kids, didn't she? Oh, so. yeah, Baby Spice. And there you go. Well, she does have some cute kids as well. So thanks for that, guys. That'll come in very handy. Right, next up, a company called Tiny Boo. Never heard of these before, but there's some awesome stuff they sent us. So cute. Um, try me. I will try you by pressing you. This is a huggy plush. And Hope it's you washable. Can it. You can take the, in, the bit inside out, obviously, and Look wash it. change. LED, 15 minute turn off, just put it on a 30 degree wash, jobs are good and So cute, and then this is very similar, it's another uh, another little night light, but you can clip it obviously to your bed bars or whatever, and it lights up, shake me. Oh, I actually just hit myself in my face. I think you need to pull the tab out. Oh, I need to pull Don't the pull the tab out yet, oh. you'll waste it. And a tiny boo night light, can't beat these things, when you're going in, creeping in the night, we've all been there, ninja, you can't quite make it out because it's not dark enough. Anyway, it's changing colour inside. So they all match! LED, yeah, so these products Thank you. are going to be very handy. You'll see them in future videos and vlogs, I'm sure. Oh, th this can even be a nightlight or a rattle. That's why I said shake. Very good. You don't turn it on to shake. There is a button on the back. So the next one, Jewel's Essentials Blanket. I'm going to get it out. I think this is one of my, what, what's those things? You Obsessions. Know I have so many blankets. This is absolute quality. So the picture here just shows inside the pram. We're coming towards summer, so... You don't necessarily have to use it in your pram. No, you don't, not at all, not at all. Um, they do a range of different things, but, it's but it, feel the quality. It smells amazing. Go on, let's hold it Yeah, up. it's a nice big blanket. Lined. It is fully lined. Quality, 40 degree mm. wash, wash up nicely. <laughs> you can feel the quality. Yeah, I love blankets. Literally most of my wardrobe is full of blankets and this is amazing. 100% organic, there you go. Designed in the Netherlands, do I need to say any more? Gorgeous. Lovely. Gorgeous. So this next is of BornGifted.com. Um, they do amazing things. They've even sent a bag with two Luke at Blandy Parent. Um, best wishes from Born Gifted. So how lovely is that? You can personalise it. Now, not only is this cool, this alone is cool, but it comes in a, a set of two. Basically, when you become a parent, you realise you have no energy left. So there's that there that my lovely wife will hold. But what does it come with? Of course. Ah, uh, I just thought it was a t-shirt. So while your baby's full of energy, you've got none. <laughs> Brilliant gift, born gifted. They've got all sorts of different cool items. That's such a cute, that's such a good present. It's always the mums that get the presents, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. It's always the mums that get the presents, but that's a cute, that's a really cute dad. It takes two present. to tango. It does. I'll go up to do the things behind me now. First things first. Wisp, wisp bear. There you go. The hugging bear. 
the, the, the humming bear. It's basically a white noise machine, but um, the legs, I really don't want to open it yet because it's just keeping don't on nice. Don't open it yet then. So um, the legs are like magnetic, so you can clip it to your cot or pram or wherever. Um, really excited to use these. Um, with Travis and Roman, I'm, I've had nights where I've given up my phone for the night because I've had a white noise machine on my phone in yeah. hopes that it would help. Which isn't very safe. To, oh. I'm getting, I'll lose my phone for a night. Thanks for the cost. My it loses all my battery. Whereas this is actually for them durable and washable light, lifetime guarantee. Soft and cuddly. This lady's so, yes. got it on her arm, over her arm when she's holding the baby. So I guess you can just carry it around with you, can't you? So that's the bits and pieces sorted out. Now we go to food. So obviously we can't do a lot of this for a little while, but we'll show you what's on the market at the moment. First things first, babies bag full of stuff. Just pick one out at random, my dear. This one, organic, wonderfully textured, butternut squash, guan. <laughs> quinoa. Quinoa. Guan, I was going to say. <laughs> quinoa and beetroot with onion and sage. That sounds like some sort of Michelin star restaurant food. It does. Um, anyway. <laughs> guana. Guana. Qu I'm thinking of something guano. else. Guano. Guano. <laughs> um, no added salt. UK company as well. Always Gluten good. and dairy free. Sorry, I'm cutting you off. Stage two, suitable from plus seven months. This one, for example, is plus four months. So I presume the texture is a little bit fine. Yeah. There is that the word. Uh, sweet potato, Smooth. carrot, and cauliflower smoother. Just one more. I'll choose at random. Um, broccoli, parsnip, green, and pie lentils. I don't, yeah, something lentils. Sorry. Amazing. That's another seven months one. But anyway, go check them out, babies. I've heard they're really good. One of friends of mine. Um, uses these at the moment and she swears by them so that's enough for me. Googly fruit. Forget Jamie Oliver and Deliciously Ella. There's a new team in town looking to help our children make a lifelong friendship with fruit and veg. <laughs> Googly fruit. Um, crunchy, crunchy puffs, corn and tomato. What flavor, what, like corn the nibbling tomato. snack. Corn and carrot. I'm going to try one. I'm try one, yeah. Them. So this is googly fruit. I've heard of these um, purely because I'm in the parenting world nowadays. Mm. Um, what flavour are these? Carrot and corn. They're like the little puffed, what's it, what's it type, crispy things. But yeah, they are organic. We're going to try and keep organic this time around. Mm. Try and keep everything nice and fresh. Fresh fruit, veg, and obviously these. Oh, handy. Do you know what I like that it says in the back of here? We are handy little snacks and almost crumb free. Now then. Yeah, I was going to say, I, don't, I didn't have any crumbs going down, which is unusual even for me. So yeah, no. check out Googly Fruit. Mm. What a good idea. The boys well, are going to eat these in a minute. I'm gonna yeah, I'm going to have to hide them. <laughs> piccolo, piccolo, piccolo. Let's have a look what's in here. There you go, there's one. Sun ripened tomato and red pepper with a dash of olive oil. Nice. These are from from around six months. So six months is when you're supposed to start weaning, but yeah. I know some babies are a bit earlier. I hopefully want to try and push it towards more of the six month point. Nature, nurture, nourish. Gluten free, no added sugars and salt. Always good. Ten percent of profits to food education. Oh. So there you go. Um, we're always supporting brands that um, do go that extra mile. Mm. Um, this one's from around seven months. Um, I guess what I mean, you can they're all so different, aren't they? And there's a Stanley, Stanley plum. plum. So that's more of a, <laughs> you know, just pour this out onto a spoon. You can warm it up, micro you can microwave. Oh, cold. What's that one? Never microwave the pouch, but obviously warm them up. Yeah, if you're gonna, if you're gonna have them warm, squirt, squirt them out into a bowl. Blushing berries, pear and banana. Pure banana. Always, oh, the puddings always sound so good, don't they? Our boys love banana flavoured yeah. stuff. So, anyway, that's brilliant. Awesome. Williams Pear. Why have all these people, why have they all got names? Stanley Plum, Williams Pear. Don't know, we'll Is have to do our research. That? We probably should have done our research before starting this, but yeah. Can, I just, can I just read you the ingredients yeah. for this one? This is the Williams Pear. Organic pears, organic lemon juice. That's, and that's it. That's what you want to hear. You don't want numbers A, B, E, D, 12, no, 16. It's scary, isn't it? So that's the food bit done. So not in today's mega haul, but in previous reviews I've done, we've done the cot, which is over there. I'll the picture. Nina, Nana, multi-purpose cot that goes from a cot 
to a high chair to like a stacking system. Storage system. We've got a review to do. Um, we've done a review on the British Baby Box, which is a UK company, which is brilliant. Um, we've got to do two pram reviews on a Chico and Britax. Britax. So look out for them. But we couldn't fit all that on the bed. So <laughs> this is what we've managed to do. I think we're quite prepared, aren't we? I think so. 14 days to go. Thanks for watching today, guys. Um, can't wait to share with you a little baby. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.